Come up and show you there's a long way from home. Welcome to the pleasure drome. Guy said drome. That is very bright. Um, I, I haven't had a problem with deliveries until today. Emotiva sends me this Air Motive 12, the SAS, SE12, which is like the little uh, eight inch that had the front and bottom firing with all the connections that were amazing. This should be the 12 inch version. And then I get my email and it's like a UPS has delivered. And I went, oh, speak of the devil. Amazon Prime is delivering right this second. See where they are? Right in front of my door where they're going to put the boxes in front of my door and I'll step back so I don't make eye contact and it's a little bit homosexual. Although it could be a woman, let's see. It can't be homosexual if it's a woman. Unless it's a butch woman. Oh God, there's reflections. Oh, it's there, there. All right, forget it. By the way, if you're too lazy to pull the thing out, yeah. Put a privacy screen out. Anyway, um, I, my mail, left at mailbox. What? You see, my mailbox is a drive down the fucking driveway. And sure as shit, sure as fucking shit, there it is. There's my mailbox. There's this box. And you notice I'm in my Corolla. Because you like, mm, like it's not just like, oh, just pick it up and walk. It's like 600 feet to my fucking mailbox. It's the first time UPS or anybody has fucked me. US Postal Service, they don't come up the driveway unless they have a package too big to fit in the mailbox. And then they'll just drive up the driveway, place it on my stoop, and then they'll leave. They'll ring the doorbell, I'll acknowledge it, and then they'll leave. But um, Whoever the UPS driver was to drop this fucker off, and I could probably call and complain, and maybe I should so it doesn't happen again. Um, you don't leave packages on the road. Moron. So I had to go and like drive my car down, barely fit this in the mad Rolla, because it's a 97 Corolla in the front seat. Ugh. Ugh. I wouldn't have moved here if that was the case. You are aware of that, right? Like I asked that question. Like this house, as Church of Zio says it is, uh, would have been off stricken from the list if I didn't get deliveries like to the door. But FedEx, DHL, and UPS up until this point have been pretty phenomenal. And obviously the prime trucks outside. Because everybody's got long ass driveways and they know you want to buy things. They know they want to sell them to you. So let's hope this isn't a trend. Also, God bless. I'm in God's country now, so I got to believe that God has told me to buy these image stabilizing binoculars. Let's see if I can whip out a demo again. It's been a while. There we go. Look down there. I'm going to stabilize. Oh, baby, look at that. It's obviously clearer when you're not a camera pressed against it. But I was able to use these to actually verify that there was a very strange looking package 600 feet away. Otherwise, it would have been a all my hair, all my quarantine hair. I got to find a barber I trust. Or I'm just going to shave my head. Sorry, pasta. I know she likes long hair, but it, I haven't buzzed my head in a couple years. Girls tend to like just, you know, hair. <sighs> Power cord. But yeah, I use the binoculars to see if I have, I, I've used them several times. Uh, first I used it to see if the garbage had been picked up on my block and it had, the house over there is garbage bells are empty. So I didn't get to bring my garbage out that day. And today I just used them to uh, verify that uh, UPS fucked me a bit. A little bit of fucking. By the way, Prime Guy should be delivering poison for the spiders. So, yay, spider poison. Ugh. Oh, that's right, they were gonna send me the wireless thing as well. We'll go get that box off the porch. Virtual coup. I wanna write NT right there, so bad, so bad. Virtual cunt, I just wanna do it. I just watching the boys. That's all he says. That's all my boy Bones there says. Fucking Billy Butcher is like, you fucking cunt. And I'm just like, this is the greatest show ever. Um, so are these labeled any differently? 
the one T and the one R. I guess one's a transmitter and one's a receiver. So this will be the first subwoofer I hook up in the house. I haven't hooked up any subwoofers. Uh, maybe I'll use this wireless system. I mean, honestly, bringing this up the driveway and into my room here is probably still easier than trying to get my rhythmic out of the basement. So there's that. Okay, so here's a transmitter. Uh, it's a shame it's only mono. I was hoping it was stereo, then I could use it for other things. So you got a pair, you got a line, put it, and oh my god, they've got a USB mini power. You're too pretty to put something on top of. Is it the same on this end? Yep, they're identical units. Line output. Is that the only place it says different? Oh, one says T and R, okay. They're both, how do, USB mini? I mean, you, yeah, not even micro, mini. Which would make this probably a USB mini power adapter, which I'm gonna need because frankly, well, I still have to charge my Hero 4s. My Hero 4s are all USB mini. So there's that. I mean, you can't get more basic than that. There's just a pairing button and the end. So that's, this will be interesting. I'll like to see how far this will go. Maybe I can put one up here and put the subwoofer from the basement. I mean, all it has to do is send like sub 250 hertz signals, which do not, do not need a lot of fidelity. Very far, very fast, so you don't have any delay. Oh God, there's another thing down there. What's that now? Okay, hold on. I guess that's a subwoofer. Why is there another one? I'm gonna have to lay this on its side. We definitely have feet here that have impacted the side of the box. And if I wanna be a super badass, I'll tuck these under. All right, let's give a yank. A yank, a guh, uh, yank. What are you? Another receiver. Why would they send me two receivers and one transmitter? Unless they'll all receive, if I, can I pair them in a triple kit? Is this a different model number? No. Weird, I'll have to ask Nick why. There's three of those. I, excuse the squeaky floor thing, it's still that day, so. Let's go see if the prime truck has gone. They have. Look, see, convenience. I walk out, I grab box, I close door, I lock it. The automated sentry drones arm again and everyone dies if they come near the house. That's all I wanted. Not to go get my fucking car to bring the heaviest stupid thing up to my goddamn house. Uh, all right, uh, this is gonna involve getting on my knees. There's some tape here. I'm trying to peel the tape off. Okay. That'll get stuck to something in a second. I'm sure of it. You know, a 12-inch subwoofer, we usually would feel big. But this space, this space is begging for a dual 18. Just fucking begging for it. You can go up here, so I throw you out. Hi. Now you are identical to the 12-inch that Emotiva sent me, I think, as far as like, what you look like. I think? I can't tell if it's a different driver. Let's take you off, put you here. Oh, it's okay, it's okay, baby. So, oh, down firing 12, front firing 12. And if we let this rotate a bit, 
We've got 60, 80, 100 hertz cutoffs for the RCAs, which is the unique feature the S8 had. This is the SE12, because I have an S12, which now this is the SE12. So we have the high level in and out. Oh, it's just one set. So I could actually just send an alternate set to this. Your crossover 60 to 150, your volume in a max, your phase switch, power auto or on. There's no off. This is the off here. So, rocks a little bit. Oh, baby. I guess I should get you going. Oh, my, my hip. It's fine. It's fine. It's all fine. Look at that 12 inch subwoofer. How about his dwarf by the space now? Let's see if Chewbacca figures out where I moved her litter box because I just moved it because she was, it was the whole thing. She was peeing. She was missing the little lip and it was going behind and under. It was, my day has not been fantastic. However, I did finish the boys season one again. And so that's got, look, that's looked forward to some triangle speakers and please don't have pooped in my, in my litter. Just don't poop. By the way, I realize there's a lot of symmetry in this house with like centering of things. Like everything centers and is equidistant, except for those spaces between the doors is slightly off by an inch. Don't think about it. I won't every day of my life. Okay, we good? I'll open that up later. Uh, that, that's poison, I'm sure. <laughs>